feel like an insect was in there. It was made by an insect. The mask, the rose white clay mask. Thick. Sleeping glove. I my sleeping. Hi there, I love the sleepy squirrels. I hope that you are all well. This evening I am unboxing. Strangely, as it is October slash November, a double summer box from Gloria. <laughs> and that is because when I signed up to Gloria like a while ago, got like this deal where there was like some boxes from the past, that sort of thing. I think I may have already unboxed all of them apart from this one. And this is, I think they're 2022 or maybe 21, um, a double summer box thing. I think, or if it was, or maybe it was like a, a limited edition or something. Inside, feel free to skip ahead. Timestamps are down below. Otherwise, enjoy.
So now that we're hopefully nice and relaxed, let's have a little look at this knot box. We have a little, um, I would say more toiletries bag than a makeup bag. You like the size of it. It has Gloria written on the front. It's kind of like a pale, oatmeal-y grey with a light trim it has some structure to it but I feel like that's because the products are in there okay let's have a little look inside fresh summer is this just a one-off kind of summer box? Oh, that's pretty. Fresh Summer Gloria. It doesn't have a month written on it, so I think it must have been like a, a one-off. Blanche. It's regenerating um, white clay in this super pink packaging. La Rose Mask en Stick Regenerant 3 en 1. Largy Blanc. 3 in 1 Regenerating Mask. tried this and it's interesting but kind of awkward and I smell it through the side I don't want to get my hands all in it to remove that yeah that smells lovely there is kind of a rose scented touched it so I have used it it's a nice feeling but it just felt a little strange and then I'm thinking because you like put it all over your face and then you pop the lid back on is that just gonna have bacteria growing on the surface of it? I don't know, I thought about that I guess you're supposed to use it on clean, dry skin they always say that but still yeah, clean, dry skin avoiding the eye area only 5 minutes in a thick layer Okay, so that's quite cool. 
Well, I now have two, so I may actually pass this on to someone. Um, just because it's quite heavy, so I feel like the other one will, will last me a while. So I might as well let somebody else get use out of this. Okay, that's a good start. I like it. This next one I have had a few times. Um, and quite a while ago, it was probably the last time, and I sent it to my brother, who has a lovely beard, and I thought he could use it for his beard. So it is a balm, a multi-purpose balm. Les Petits Protégés. I got something from... What box was it? Gloria, this month, from them. It was like a a face wash in powder form. So this one is like, um, I guess, I would say it's kind of like, um, Vaseline or something. Like a very, I don't know, like maybe Vaseline is a little softer than this. It has no odor. So yeah, that's pretty cool because you can really use it how you want. So almond oil, omega 9, it's a rich in omega 9. Without essential oils, I actually really appreciate that. You can use for women, men, children, babies, sensitive skin, and so you can use it also on your face, your body, your lips, your hands to remove makeup after sun, the ends of your hair, on your beard, and little scrapes and cuts. So I appreciate this and I think this is pretty full size. I've had a smaller version of this, so this is a full size one. That is very much appreciated. This is the sleeping club thing. What is it? Exfoliating? What is it? Cocoon de soie exfoliant. Seven uses. Silk beauty. I don't know what this is. Antibacterial. Hypoallergenic. And they're cotton. Exfoliant. Hold on, let me open this and see what this is. We have this little bag. This what feels like little styrofoam things inside. I'm guessing they're not styrofoam. It looks very like organic and things like that. It does look like these little styrofoam things. You're like packing peanuts. Oh, they're hollow. That's so weird. I feel like an insect was in there. It was made by an insect. It's for your finger. Oh, that's so weird. Why is it? I really feel like this is like some sort of cocoon made by an insect. So, there are seven uses because there are seven of these. You don't use them seven times each. So, you get one of these. You leave it in warm, like lukewarm water for one to two minutes. And then use it on your face with little circular movements. And then rinse. Okay. That's actually really interesting. Why sleeping club? I guess to do it like to relax before you sleep. But what? Is it just for exfoliating purposes or does this have some sort of thing? Toutes les peaux en particulier sont sensibilisées par les coutons. I don't understand. I guess. 
if something, especially if you're irritated by cotton pads, they're good for you. 13 euros for this little box. I'm really interested. <laughs> I really like it. Okay, so this will be getting passed on, but it's a really nice product. This one, I might actually save this one for myself. I gave the others away. And this is really intriguing. I might want to use that already tonight. <laughs> okay. The next item. Told you it began with a P. Pompon. Pompon. And it is a lipstick. A green lipstick. Rouge à joli sourire. Rosetto. Bois de rose. Seems like a very me color. Yeah, I think that's my kind of color. It's really pretty. Maybe even slightly dark for me. And I have a feeling that I may already have this color in this exact lipstick. I'm not sure. I don't think this is a matte version. I feel like I have this but matte. One that's slightly like it. So this is natural and vegan and hydrating. Shea butter, etc, etc. Okay, I don't know if I will keep this one just because I have so many similar ones that, I mean, I'm not really the kind of person that goes through lipsticks. It's very rare for me. Someone who doesn't mind it. I've swatched it on my hand already. Okay. So, a nice first four. Let's see what we have after. Talika soa liposila. I've heard that word before, liposila. Sil is like um, eyelashes in French. Eyelash growth gel inspired by repairing techniques stimulates growth and thickness Talika Paris since 1948 um, I feel like I already have this product so Talika who created the first treatment for eyelash growth Because first <laughs> treatment for eyelash girl. That's so funny. They've got like a little star. So it's like Talika who created the first treatment for eyelash growth. Little star. Talika's first treatment. <laughs> In 1948 introduces liposil or liposil formula composed of five plant extracts. So after, tw I don't really care about that kind of thing, it's fine. Um, by Talika, clinical test, 15 subjects, 28 days. Longer by 1.6 millimeters on average. I wonder what your normal eyelash growth is in 28 days. Maybe it's just like, um, just under like 1.5 millimeters or something. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I'm sure this kind of thing is good for your eyelashes. Yeah, I have this already. I have not used it though. I have a Grand Seal one. <laughs> so I'm using the Grand Seal one. And the Grand Seal one isn't in um, this form. It isn't in a Kind of mascara, spoolie, that's it. It's not in spoolie form, it's like a little eyeliner kind of form. So it just goes on the roots. I don't know. I don't quite like it. Um, did I smell that? I did not. I wonder if it smells of anything. I think it does. Yeah, it smells a little 
of something like chemical E, not like nice, but it's not strong, it's fine. Eyelash conditioning gel with liposomes or liposome. I don't really know what that is. Okay, so that's cool. And then we have our toothbrush from Earth to Earth Bamboo. Um, Happy New Year, apparently. Biodegradable, compostable, recyclable, um, bristles, durable, and vegan. Eco yay, twice a day. Manufactured in the UK, made in China. Okay. So you can compost the actual brush, like the handle, and then you can recycle the bristles. So you kind of got to separate them, I guess. Let's have a look at it. So we have the Earth Organization here. Personne ne survit seul, because nobody survives alone. Yeah. Lawrence Anthony, Earth Organization. That's cute. I feel like this is cool, um, the yellow part, because usually when I have uh, bamboo toothbrushes, it's the ick. I get the ick from the bottom of the bamboo getting like soaking up water and getting like a little oof, you know? But I feel like if it's painted at the bottom, it might not do that so much, you know? It might be a little more waterproof here. I like it. I not so. fit. From earth to earth. And fit is like, it's like a fate. bristles too. I don't want, I feel like I want to go like that, but I'm going to use it for my teeth, so let's not do that. Okay, that's pretty cool too. It's nice. I wonder how often you have to change them. Because like with others, it's like every six months, but maybe with them, Nude experience. Copenhagen nail polish. Copenhagen is the name of the, the color. So it's supposed to be like a hydrating polish. And the aloe vera. It's vegan, cruelty free. Aloe vera and unseed oil? What's unseed oil? Vidula. Linseed oil? Yeah. <laughs> the L and the I are kind of squished. Looks like an, a capital U. It's linseed oil. <laughs> unseed oil. It's a pretty nice color. Formula wise, I have no idea. It's been a very long time. It's very liquidy. It's been a very long time since I actually painted my own nails and not just painted some press ons, and usually with gel, to be honest. So it's pretty nice. I'll probably get it passed on though. Cool. Alikia Beauty. Ah, uh, that was the pattern I saw. On this packaging, Elikia Beauty Cosmetics Natural Vegan Mattifying Base. Mm, that's cool. So there seems to be a choice of two different ones. Like there's a poreless one and a hydrating one. This is mattifying. This is mattifying or hydrating? Sure. 
mattifying mattifying base and I draw with pink clay and jojoba oil in a single gesture the skin is matte the pores are blurred okay so this is the poreless one the complexion is bright and fresh this primer with pink clay and carrot extract helps absorb excess oil that's pretty cool You can see it's the kind of pinkish one. I love the two. It's a very over the top bottle, don't you think? It's plastic, it's not metal, but let me just scoosh. Oh, okay, that's a lot. I didn't mean to scoosh so much. Let me just dab a little off. Okay, so it's quite liquidy. And I have dabbed already quite a lot off, but it's, I have no idea if that's reducing my hand pores or not. <laughs> um, I can see the mattifying, I can feel it as well. Um, it's going to be used on my face to actually see if it changes anything about pores. Because, yeah, it's my hand, so it definitely feels very different. Like, it feels like a completely different base to work on. Okay, that's definitely interesting. I usually use like one of those like color correcting um, green primers. So I'm more for that, but I'm definitely interested in reducing pores. So this next product is definitely <laughs> a triple, maybe quadruple at the moment. I have been unboxing these um, Garantia Tomato Diabolical Tomato Creams left and right <laughs> for the last few months. So, I mean, I'm not mad about it. I like it a lot. I'm not going to break the seal on this one because I already have like I will be passing this one on just because I have so many but I do like it excuse my throat <laughs> it's like catching a little um, I have a cold and it's like been on and off for a little while so my voice gets really strained quite easily especially filming ASMR <laughs> so excuse that sorry so yeah this is great um, if you don't have like super dry skin because it is like a water cream it's definitely gonna give you that kind of really natural glow it's really nice okay and it smells absolutely gorgeous if you've ever smelled Garantia in general you know what I'm talking about but if you've smelled this you know if you know you know we have one more thing. Is it in here? Oh, it's not in here. Okay. So the last thing is not in here. So we're just gonna have to wing it. But it looks pretty self explanatory. Blue Radiance Enzymatic Serum with pomegranate enzymes, probiotics, and plant derived. Salicylates. 99.9% .9 natural ingredients. A lot of ingredients. It's exfoliating facial serum. Two to three drops at night as the last step of the routine. Avoid contact with eyes mucous membranes, damaged skin, external is only, okay. Shake before use. Okay, let's have a look at this. Of course, it's a glass bottle. Happy about that. Um, it looks like it would come in a glass bottle. With this kind of like cardboard, like raw cardboard sort of thing. Okay. Frosted glass. And it looks actually blue. It's not the bottle that's blue, I think it's what's inside. Okay, that's cute. 
the future of cosmetics is here, natural, healthy, and sustainable. The best natural and innovative formulas for healthy skin. That all sounds very lovely. I might do it on this hand because this has got like. It's definitely blue. <laughs> it's your last step at night before you go to sleep, so it's not going to mess with your makeup. It smells... Mm, it smells nice. And I don't know what off yet, but... So, you can kind of see it, but it's not going to leave like your face blue. <laughs> Let's smell. Oh, wow. Yeah, you can really smell that. I guess, like, yeah, you can smell the pomegranate and whatnot. What else did it say? I guess that's pomegranate. It feels like a kind of dusty, <laughs> dusty smell to it. Like a dusty, fruity, sugary smell. It's definitely nice. It's leaving my skin a little tacky, but I mean, it's a night serum. It's very smooth. Okay, we'll have to see how to dry it out. Oh, is my hand tingling? So my hand is starting to tingle. Like, I'm not sure if it's like an allergic reaction or if it's supposed to tingle. It doesn't say anything about tingling on the bottle. So I'm gonna let, like, that sit on my hand for a while to make sure that I'm not going to have like a full-blown allergic reaction before I put it on my face. Oh, I didn't shake it before I used it. Maybe that's why. I doubt it's going to change much though. It looks pretty just as thick. That is everything. It's pretty nice. I really like that. Okay, I'm just gonna pop everything back into this makeup bag, toiletry bag. We have our serum, the night serum, which is still kind of tingling on my hand. It's not red or anything yet, so maybe it's nothing. It smells lovely though. We have our Diabolical Tomato Cream, which we'll probably be getting passed on. I love it, but I have a lot of them. <laughs> okay, what else do we have? We have our Pore Shrinking or Covering <laughs> Blurring Primer. Definitely going to be using that at least a few times to dry it. Talika Eyelash Rotted Gel We'll see about that one My eyes are pretty sensitive Oh yeah, we have these Sleeping Club Cocoon Silk things <laughs> Look like little cocoons Exfoliating Silk It looks like little bugs were in there, like they're little cocoons. It literally says silk cocoons on the front of it. I was thinking cocoon, like cocooning, like um, they would say in French, like, you know, when you get all cozy at home, that's cocooning. <laughs> it's funny. Okay. We have our little balm from Le Petit Potiche. I think I'll keep that. The mask, the rose white clay mask. I think I'll be passing this on just because I already have a nice full size one, exactly the same. Little 
Pump On Lipstick, which looks pretty cute, but I think I will pass this on because I think I definitely have the same one already. Nude Experience Polish, and I think I'll be passing this on too because I just really don't really do polish anymore. Um, I'm all about the gel and press-ons and That's pretty much it. The Starlet Art Bamboo Toothbrush to add into the mix. And that's everything. That is a really lovely box and I feel like it doesn't even have to be a summer box. It's a nice fresh summer box but it's also just a nice box for any time of the year. So I am going to leave this video here for this evening. I hope that you enjoyed this video, that you found it relaxing and interesting to see what was in this limited edition summer bag from Gloria. I don't think it's available anymore. It's in one of those past kind of deal things. But yeah, I'm sure they'll have similar ones each year. Okay. So, I hope that every single one of my sleepy squirrels are well. Wherever you are in the world. Whatever's happening around you. I hope you can find your own little bubble of gum. For example, if you are in New York City, New York, in the USA, like Emma, hey Emma, hope you're fine, hope you're well. And I hope that you all have a lovely, and I'll 